Yeah, and first cast of the morning. Let's see what we got here. We got white bass. Still throwing the, the spoon and Carolina or the Carolina rig spoon set up. First cast, right off the bat, got me a fish, so pretty excited about that. Back in the water. Let's see if we can do it again. There he is right there. Oh, that was an awesome jump. And that is why they're known as Tennessee Tarpon. Sea fish jump and jump and jump. It's some pretty good fish too. That. Big old fatty. Hook right in the bottom of the jaw. Skip Jack Herring, Tennessee Tarpon. There you go again. I made four casts this morning and missed four fish. I caught one and missed two, so I ain't doing too bad. There's another fish. This is a green fish. Assessment so much to get it in. It's a little large mouth. Spoon up there again. So I hook up another fish. At 
they believe that's a lab man out there in the boat. It's a fellow CFF member and fishing for them here locally. That's my first cast. I've not caught a fish or had a bite. But I'm gonna change it, I hope. Yep, another fish. This is unreal. I've made seven or eight casts and I've either had a fish on or caught one on six of the six or seven of them so I'm pretty good this is a good white bass big old fatty and guys if you don't have any of these these little foley spoons that spur hunter selling <laughs> you ain't gonna catch no fish because there's a guy over here next to me He's made probably 30 casts and ain't got a bite. I've made about eight casts and I've caught four fish. So, and then I lost three, so you do the math. You don't see what I'm using is, it's a, uh, what's called a Foley spoon. And this resembles a dying bait fish. So when this falls, it'll fall this way and just flutter back and forth. It's also known as a flutter spoon. And I've got 12 pound fluorocarbon leader. I'm using 10 pound braid and then I'm just using a bullet sinker on a swivel. Now I do not use a bead when I use braid because the, braid, the bead will uh, cause the braid to wear it breaks out pretty easily. I found that to be an issue, so I just put a straight sinker on, swivel, 12 pound fluorocarbon, then a spoon. And that's what I'm killing these fish on right now. There was a couple of local fishermen down here. Uh, throwing, one was throwing a fly, one was throwing a popper cork, and they caught one fish, and I'm up to about probably 12 or 13 fish now. So they've already gave up and left, and I'm still here catching fish. So you gotta try these spoons out when you get a chance. Got a fish busting right here beside me. I don't know if you heard it. <laughs> 